That's right, Jason right Mena. Um, this is at four volts. Oh. Um, yeah, so yeah, I'm using a, uh, a cork as a commutator with uh, aluminium foil. Uh, that's fine, as you can see. Um, I focus, but uh, you know, there's gaps in that aluminium foil because of the, uh, the sparks, I believe, and also the friction from the brushes. Um, yeah, there's splits in the commutator, so uh, the current can switch uh, direction. But, um, yeah, I'm not sure why it stops the fan. Um, this thing works pretty well on the uh, exam day, or test day, whatever you want to call it. Uh, yeah, we've got some pretty good magnets here. This is a magnet. Um, yeah, the coil, I think, is just a bit over 50 turns. Uh, and then we've got, around the back, um, we have the ends of the wire just pushed into the cork, and then... Uh, that goes through the aluminium, of course, because it's covered at the back as well, so then, uh, then the current can flow into the commutator. Uh, hopefully it's going to work. I was at 4 volts just before, so I'm not sure why it stopped. There we go. Uh, today it did start with, uh, without me touching it, so uh, I sort of broke it today as well. So you can see it's working pretty well. I'll just put up the six bolts. Uh, eight, anyone? <laughs> the knob doesn't want to turn. Eight bolts. The turn is really fast, and then 10, and then 12, you see the spark there. It's starting to stop now, and it's smoking. Yeah, so that's uh, the motor. Uh, I think I just broke it again. Um, so, yeah, thanks.